Ma'am, would I lie to you? And round one is all about embarrassing stories. And this is a Mother's Day game, so we need a ma'am. So let's go back to our virtual audience and surprise you, Pat Thompson in Poulton. Thank you, Pat. Pat's all dressed up. Surprise, <laughs> Pat. All dressed up and nowhere to go. Now, we've got another surprise for you, Pat, because you didn't know this, but your daughter, Rachel, is actually here in the studio oh. with us tonight. Yes, she is here. Now, listen up. She's going to be joined by two imposters who are also pretending to be your daughter. Yes, they'll each tell a story about you, and the panel's job here is to work out who's telling the truth and who's telling a lie. Now, obviously, Pat, you know who your daughter is, so we need you to keep your best poker face, otherwise it'll be too easy for our panel. So don't yep. give anything away. Poker face at the ready, please, Pat. And let's welcome all three Rachels. Oh, wow. They look just alike. Oh, wow, yes, they do. Uh, welcome to the show, Rachels. Now, you're all claiming that Pat's your mom. You're each going to tell a story about her, but only one of you is Pat's real daughter, Rachel. So only one of those stories is true, but which one? OK, listen up, panel. Here we are, Rachel one. It's over to you. This is my mum, Pat. To save money, when we used to check into a hotel on holiday, she snuck me inside by hiding me in a suitcase. <laughs> there was a um, queue at reception, so I was in there for 20 minutes. Oh. 20, 20 <laughs> minutes? Thank you, Thank you Rachel, oh. number one. Great story. Rachel, number two, what's your story? This is my mum, Pat. When I was eight, I wouldn't let her brush my hair. So she took me to the hairdressers and asked them to give me a short back and side. <laughs> Everybody thought I looked like a boy and started calling me Richard. Aww. Oh, <laughs> that. Thank you, Rachel, number two. Finally, Rachel, number three. This is my mum, Pat. In an attempt to win the mum's race at school sports day, she stuck her egg to a spoon with chewing gum. <laughs> she was rumbled at the finish line when she threw her arms in the air and the egg stayed on the spoon. Ah, schoolboy, that's school girl era. So, which is the true story? Is it the suitcase oh. shocker, the horrible haircut, or the sneaky sports day? What do you think, panel? What do you think, Lee? Well, first of all, I'd like to say, uh, to find one host smaller than Rob Bryden, amazing, but to get two, <laughs> unbelievable. <laughs> and my second question is, yes. where's Dad gone? Because he was there for the first He's minute. There, yeah. out said, Look. He does not want to be a part of this. He, he spent knows the first minute just showing half a face. Did you notice? I thought, I'm yeah. not doing that. I'm going. <laughs> He's gone. Right, Lee, you know how this works. Come on, talk amongst yourselves. Who do you think it is? What do you think, Stephen? Well, interestingly, Rachel number one, your mum put you in a suitcase. That's what I do with Ant and Depp when we all go away. <laughs> 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 Um, but, but 20 minutes, what is it? 20 minutes, like? I mean, that's, that's, that's quite dangerous, isn't yeah. it? It's is dangerous. Irresponsible. Yeah, so irresponsible, they wouldn't say that on ITV. Do, do, do you think that's what the kind of person Pat is? No, but I think the husband is that. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that's why he's gone. He's gone to get the suitcase yeah. ready for his wife after the show. <laughs> Michelle. I think, I think Rachel number two, because the same exact cheap earrings, same exact <laughs> thing happened to me. My mother brought me in and just cut it right off, lobbed it right off. So I believe it's Rachel number two. Any questions you want to throw to any of the Rachel? Are they allowed to speak? A yes, no, an yes, no answers only. Okay. Yes, no answers only? Yes. All right, are they allowed to speak? <laughs> yes. <Okay. laughs> Sorry. I thought you'd just be very starry. Uh, Rachel number three, um, what, what is your mum... No, what, where are you from? Uh, Blackpool. Blackpool. That's not a yeah. yes, no answer. No. <laughs> Sorry, Rachel number three. Are you from Blackpool? Yes. Oh, yeah. Right. <laughs> I think I've nailed this. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Rachel number two is Pat your mum. What? Oh, no, we're going to go. No, he's not. You can't do that, can you? That's not we the could, spirit of things. We could go for the look. <laughs> yeah. Who yeah. looks the most like mum. Two. I'd like to compare to dad, but he's gone. Um, mm. I would say the two. most most similar looks is number three. Would that two. be for... Do you no? reckon? No. no, I was saying number two. Thank you. And number one, are you going number two? There, but I'm going to say number two. Right, you're going to have to start thinking now who you want to go for. Confer amongst yourselves and because come up with a name. It's the eyes. The eyes. Look, I, it's I the just eyes. feel like, and the smile is number the two. Smoke but if I'm wrong, the smile. It's, I didn't choose that. If I'm the wrong. smile says number two. Stephen, yeah. or her. What yeah. do you think? And right, some I'm, comedians only get to dream of saying those words. Well, <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm saying number two. You're going yeah. number two. I, yeah. I, I don't want to outvote my panel. And, and I, yeah. honestly, I would hurry up because Pat is doing a near Judy finish. Okay, you're quick. <laughs> number two. Number two. <laughs> number two. Okay. Rachel, number okay. two. Number so two. here we go. Rachel, number two. Is Pat your man? Were you telling the truth or were you telling a lie? It was the. Tree! Yeah! Yeah! Well, it was yeah. the truth. It was the dodgy haircut. Yeah. And we've got a picture to prove it as well. <laughs> Let's have a look of the short back and sides. Oh! <laughs> there it is. Look at that. <laughs> oh, wow. She's the one on the left, not the boy on the right. <laughs> uh, Pat, that was savage. Why would you do that? Uh, you haven't sat with her trying to brush your hair for hours and. No, it was a, she got warned enough times, and, and that was it. She got warned enough times. times. I mean, it was the eighties; it was a different time then. <laughs> Things were harsher then. Uh, let's hear it for Pat's actual daughter, Rachel, and our two pretend Rachel. Yeah, Rachel. I like that. Oh, I enjoyed that. I like, I like yeah. this. Do you like this? Yeah, it's yeah, good. It's good. We should come up with a panel show.